Hey there, welcome back to The Green Room on Casting Workbook. I'm Natasha Gorgiulo, and Minions, The Rise of Gru takes place in the 1970s as Gru, voiced by Steve Carell, is trying to test the waters of supervillain life with his tiny yellow henchman. Now, Steve Carell explains the process of what it's like to voice this beloved Despicable Me character for the fifth installment. Okay, hey, are you guys pumped for the movie? Let's go! It's as much fun as you would imagine it to be because you go in, you have this script, they allow you to, obviously you do the script, you improvise as much as you want. You can add your own stuff in, your own references, maybe something silly that your kid said that day, you infuse that somehow. And sometimes when they see the movie, they're like, dad, I said that, I know, I stole it from you. You know, it's, it's really, um, it's very free and easy and fun. To me, really the most exciting part is after all that work, and it's like, like a year and a half, two years, we do you know the voices for these things as they build the animation. Then we get to go see the movie, and it's unbelievable. Like they've taken just this voice acting and turned it into an actual character, and the timing of the the, the animators comedically, and it's a spectacle. And and it's uh, like all we did is that. That's the English villains. My name is Gro. I feel like I am talking too loud. Yeah, everyone hates their voice. Like the first time you hear your voice on a, like when we were kids, we had a, you know, a rec, uh, a, you know, a tape recorder. And I couldn't believe it. Like, I, I'll never speak again. This is horrible stuff. It's like, oh no, it's that voice. And that's what I really look like. That's the most horrible thing ever. Um, yes. I, I am pretty despicable. You don't want to cross me. I think the comment, the thread to me is it's all about family. Like even, even this movie, it's about finding your tribe. It's about finding people who will have your back and that you can have their back. Like, and it's, so there's like a, a, an undercurrent of, of kindness and love and generosity and like that, that to me, it just makes the whole process a joy to be a part of. I'm not, I'm not, I swear. Cross my heart and hope to die. Stick a needle in my eye. Don't actually do that though. 